What is up everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Scramble and I'm ready to share with you today's technical analysis for Bitcoin, which is finding a lot of the panic sell and it's 25% minus in the last 24 hours. At the moment, Bitcoin is trading under $6,000, guys. If you check the market yesterday, it was trading at $8,000. Today, it is trading below six, which is more than $2,000 difference. This is going to be a shock for a lot of people which are going to wake up in the next hours and see 25% decrease on Bitcoin, 32% decrease on Ethereum. Yesterday, Ethereum was traded at 200 bucks. Today, it's traded at 135. You know what that means? Well, if you had $100,000 with this 32% decrease on the Ethereum, today you have about $68,000 in your account. So you lost like 30 grand in about 12 hours because all these things happen over the night and things are getting pretty dramatic, guys. So let's take a look at the technicals, which is something I want to discuss. All these things are caused by the panic sell on the coronavirus issue, on the coronavirus problems that are spreading all around the world and things are going out of control. Therefore, people tend to find security more in fiat currency than cryptocurrency. Just like you can see the percentages here, fiat currency is not having such a fluctuations. Not at all. So if you're one of those guys having fiat and thinking about going in fiat currency or Bitcoin, you need to find stable markets in order to be able to predict the outcome of the movements and patterns. As soon as the market is not having stability, it is not possible to predict the outcome of the markets. So this kind of environment is not good at all for the traders as well. At the moment, it's not good. It was good a couple of hours ago and I'm going to explain you why. But first, we're going to start with a short term candlestick representation where we have a clear entering into the downtrending domination power right here with a market refusal on the rejection. We try to increase the prices of the market. Bulls have stepped in looking to dominate the space with a larger volume, which has been rejected. The wick has been formed and the bears control everything by being more powerful. From there, we entered in a downtrending channel which goes just like this until that point where everything has been controlled without large or big efforts. Just like you can see, the size of the candlesticks are small. They're not wide. They have no shadows that are meaningful. They don't have anything that would tell us there was a big fight going on between the bulls and the bears. And the battle was difficult. No, it was not difficult at all. You can see how the bears controlled the market without too much efforts. Bulls were not existent in the game. That's the first phase. Just going to put it like that. The second phase appears right here, which is a sideways movement of the market. This sideways movement of the market had a strong support horizontal line located at $7,700. It was supported quite a few times, just like you can see here, here as well. We have a little false break out there and then we came back above the line with a failure to break out of the $8,000 resistance level, which is a psychological barrier from where everything started into the third phase of the market. So this was the second phase. Here is the third phase of the current pattern we have for the 15 minute charting. The third phase is a dramatic sell-off where whales exchanges, anyone that holds large quantities, those are called the whales of the market. They push the trigger and sold large quantities of the Bitcoin holdings they had. By selling large quantities and driving the market down to about 26%, just like you can see right here on my tab, 5,900 is the current price, driving it that way, putting so much energy onto the order book of the selling side. Bulls were obviously not capable holding it up and the market crashed dramatically. It's a dramatic crash. I mean, take a look at that. 
24 hours ago, we were 25% higher than now. If it's about to measure this, like 24 hours ago, if I put here, now this is crazy guys, you know, take a look at that. Well, let me just do it the correct way. From top to down, when the price is decreasing, that's how you need to measure. So you see the chart is 24.43, about 25% in one day, guys. That's insane. Going down 25% in a day for a, such a huge cryptocurrency out there, we don't really see this usually. You remember how the market has spiked about 30% in 24 hours uh, in 2019 for the BTC. Everyone is extremely enthusiastic that we can only do this from the bullish side. People are not expecting such a things from the bearish side, considering it's a new year, things are trying to pick up in 2020, considering 2019 and 18 were not the best years of the crypto space, so we're recovering. And it's actually not going like that. Due to the social and economical problems all around the world, the money is not circulating, it's not on the production, no generation of resources, people is on their pause. They are looking more on their wealth, security and health than trading Bitcoin right now. So the solution comes in here, in my opinion, to trade it from your home, get some education going on and learn how to make money. Because here we had some great patterns sharing the breakdowns of the market, which you could trade it by shorting the things. That's why I pretty much delayed this video because I needed to exit my trades. I went down and shorted the market and we've benefited a lot because we do leverage training with margin and the margin was 10x on 20% movement. That's clearly 200% achieved. You can learn more about my private one-on-one -on -one trading program on scrambocoinchick.com. Make sure you check out this one. It's four weeks intensive one-on-one -on -one with me. Check out the website and then fill out the form. I'm going to get back to you on your email. We schedule a Skype call. I'll explain you how it works. You meet me in person online and you know we sort out all the problems and issues. Now going towards the one day candlestick representation, which is probably the best one to see all these overall movements. Well, take a look at that, guys. We were in a enthusiastic manner and community type of energy since 2019, where this green line has started. It was supported at this point. It was amazing, but now it has crashed. Just like you can see it over there. I was talking about in my previous videos on the main channel I have, because I run multiple YouTube channels regarding Bitcoin. So you can check out the link in the description area and comments area for a lot of the things that I share. Please see how I was speaking about the support line, which is the green one that is sitting below the charts, how it needs to support us whenever it's going to be touched in order to have a bounce back on the market and have probabilities to break out by longs. No, we had a breakdown by shorts, which means the support has failed at this point and we crashed. We did crash till the point we have faced support at $6,000. Right now, we have an area which supports us at the moment, and that's fine. The next area is going to be located at 5,500 and 5,000. I wouldn't love to be there because that would be an insane decrease. Just a couple of days ago, we were at $10,000, and to see the market down at 5,000 in a month. That would be insane, guys. That would be insane. That's something we were seeing only and only when the market was going from 4,000 up to 20,000 back in 2017. But at this time, we were not having any 4 grand up to 20 grand, so it wouldn't be normal at all to see such a large decrease from 10 to 5. That's exactly half. And we're very, very near that. Look at that. Not going to find... 
right now any stability due to the circumstances of the social and economical world. So things are going on their high panic right now. Just wait till the entire world is going to wake up today, see the news, they're going to be dramatic on it. So take a look at that. The RSX, what you see right here, it is RSX indicator that I use instead of RSI. The RSX indicator eliminates the background noises or anything that is not productive compared to RSX that, sorry, to RSI, which is making a lot of the background noise and inefficient indicators. This guy right here is not doing those. So what we see here is the green line, which usually represents support and it shares us that whenever the market is crossing the green line, we are in the oversold area, which means that the market needs to come back because it's oversold. Now, if you see the quantity of the oversold right now is about like you know 24 here the score is about 24 25 and if we look back we had situations of being oversold down to five down to seven eight so it's possible even lower which means that the market could go even lower guys even lower that's why we need to be worried about a five grand level because if we break below that it's gonna be a huge panic again people will talk about the two thousand or three thousand dollars per btc price and there's gonna be a lot of the money loss in the market if you do not trade this that's why traders can save their ass by trading this and shorting the market making money out of this movement this is what a trader does he makes money either passive or active depends what type of trading style you want to do you want to approach that's the current situation of the market guys once again for those of you looking to learn how to trade cryptocurrency ethereum bitcoin or anything else feel free to check out scramblecoaching.com and watch the video get back to me i will have a conversation with you for anyone that's serious and looking to go deep into the journey now it's the time to learn how to trade because there is going to be a lot of the great movements in the future. We all want to see Bitcoin back to 20 grand, but I'm going to tell you, this is not going to happen only to 20 grand. This is going to go up to 50, $100,000. And if you're going to miss the boat, it's going to be hard trouble because this thing could save your financial security. It could save your life from the financial perspective then you can take care of other things and you can enjoy in the way you want this is what we're planning here to build up a large community of 500 people that i'm coaching one-on-one -on -one, where i'm going to share with them all the knowledge and skills that are necessarily just like i'm mentioning here from the three stages stage number one is psychology we lay down the foundation area in order to build on it and create your business Number two is technical analysis, which is the main business. Number three is live trading. We need to learn how to read the charts, do actions that are backed up by data. Everything that's only just because that's what the market told us and not that's because what we want. That's how trading works. So once again, guys, keep close. Um, keep yourself close to the charts, to the numbers. And feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit your opinions in the comments area, hit the like button. I would love to see you in my next videos where I'm trying to bring some information regarding the charts. Thank you once again, guys. I'm talk to you soon. Take care. And hopefully the market right now is not affecting you. Hopefully you're trading this correctly. Talk to you soon. Have a beautiful day.